One useful enhancement in SOLIDWORKS 2010 is that you can now specify separate materials for individual bodies within a multi-body part. Here I have a golf club model. This is a part file consisting of three separate solid bodies, a grip, a shaft, and a club head. In previous versions of SOLIDWORKS, you could only specify one material per part, so all three of these solid bodies would have been evaluated using the same material set of material data. Now you can override the default material and specify a new one for each individual solid body. First, I'll set the default material. I'll right-click Material in the Feature Manager tree and select Edit Material. For the default, I'll choose Cast Alloy Steel. When I click Apply, the material is added. Now I'll switch to the Evaluate tab on the Command Manager and view the mass properties. Right now, the mass of the part is about 3.5 pounds, assuming the entire club is made of cast alloy steel. I'd like the grip to be made of rubber, and the club head to be made from titanium. I'll click Close to exit the Mass Properties dialog box. If you look in the Solid Bodies folder, you can see there are indeed three individual solid bodies for this part. I'll right-click the club head in the Solid Bodies folder and select Material, Edit Material. I'll choose one of the titanium alloys and click Apply. Notice a plus sign has appeared next to the clubhead body. When I expand the body, you can see the new material listed beneath it. I'll add a rubber material to the grip body. Now when I go to Mass Properties, you can see the weight has decreased pretty significantly. SOLIDWORKS is now evaluating the mass, assuming the club head is made from titanium, the grip from rubber, and the shaft is the default steel. If you decide you want to change or remove the material from a particular solid body, all you need to do is right-click the body in the Solid Bodies folder and select either Remove Material to remove the body to the part default material or Edit Material to specify a new material for the solid body.